The one and only reason why the Bible seemed to be a contradictory book, or the God within the Bible seemed to be a contradictory God, or the God within the Bible seemed to be a cruel God, the one and only reason why the Bible stories did not seem to add up, one would say one thing and then the other story would say another thing and they both contradict themselves, is because the Bible is not literal. It is symbolic, you see. Stories within stories within stories. Parables within parables within parables. Symbols within symbols within symbols, you see. Wheels within wheels within wheels, you see. The Bible is not a literal book, you see. When you are able to decode and understand and see all of the mysteries that are hidden in these symbolic stories you will hold the key of the universe within your hand you will understand how the universe operates you see when it comes to humanity and when it comes to creation you will have the key within your hand if you are able to decode these stories accurately you see the answers and the secrets of the universe are within these stories you see the power of the occult are within these stories you see when we look at the symbolic story of Samson, it is shedding light upon a nation of people, a called people, a chosen people, a star seed who have the ability to decode the Bible, you see. In the symbolic story of Samson, you will see that Samson created a riddle, you see. Samson created a riddle that no one could solve. They tried to solve this parable, they tried to solve this mystery, they, they tried to decode this story, this parable, this riddle that Samson created, but no one in the entire town could decode it, you see. Only Samson could decode this symbolic story, for he was the creator of the symbolic story, you see. This is shedding light upon a nation of people that are of the heart of the divine, you see, within their DNA, within their bloodline, within their essence, within their being, they carry the decoding factor of all the secrets that are within the symbolic Bible, you see. This is also shedding light upon Esau and Jacob, you see. The Bible is not literal. God cannot hate, you see. That frequency cannot hate. That energy cannot hate. That divine consciousness, that divine frequency is pure love. It cannot hate. God, creator source, cannot hate. What is the symbolic meaning in this symbolic story of Esau and Jacob? That divine mind, that divine consciousness, that divine frequency, which is called or referred to as the Tao, that divine essence, cannot be on the same frequency of hate. That divine mind cannot be in the same vicinity, the same parameters, the same energy. Is not found, cannot operate, does not exist in its opposite self. That divine mind is everything opposite of darkness. Therefore, that divine mind cannot hate. In the symbolic Bible where it says, God loved Jacob, but hate Esau, this is symbolic. Why is this symbolic? Because the divine mind cannot hate. The divine mind is opposite, complete opposite, in its perfected sense of whatever it is that is dark or negative, which is hate, which is jealousy, which is envy. The divine mind knows not darkness. The divine mind knows not negativity. The divine mind is pure light and love. This is the essence of all created things, you see. God hated Esau and loved Jacob is symbolic of two different types of people, you see. Jacob is the symbolic representation of the line or the lineage of people from which the creator source placed his seal, placed his promises. These are the children of the divine. In other words, these are the original creation of the divine. Anything else, anything else is considered Esau. These particular descendants of Jacob are the original creation of that divine mind within their bloodline within their essence, within their vibration, within their spirit, within their energy, 
is the divine in its purest form you see this is why it was symbolically important to keep the bloodline pure within the symbolic bible for these are the purest form of the creation of the divine you see anything else is not of the purest form of the divine which is why the symbolic bible says jacob i love esau i hate it's simply shedding light upon the heart and the creation and the origin